But still, you would think against the so-called smaller man, we'd see yeah. something more. Yeah. But I think Jim summed it up. There's too much of everything. He just cannot figure out how to get into the fight, how to hold him off, how to get to him. It's too much of everything tonight. He's maybe trying to lay a trap, but Manny is too smart and too fast for him. This fight's going to probably end up being stopped. Manny Pacquiao yeah. is annihilating Oscar De La Hoya. And in the seventh round, De La Hoya has zero answers for the Pacquiao assault. No, no, he cannot do anything. He can't Pacquiao is him. making De La Hoya look old, slow, ineffectual. As though he is a sparring well, Manny sport. Pacquiao would become the Henry Armstrong of this era right now. He's looking like the immortal Armstrong. And Tony, Tony, Oscar Tony, is Tony barely Weeks slowing is back. Very seriously you wonder if Tony fight. Weeks is thinking of stopping the fight. Yes. Who's looking Hard entirely shots. at Oscar? Deloya hasn't been down, but that may be the only thing that's keeping Weeks from stopping it. Oscar's left eye is almost closed. <laughs> An embarrassing seventh round comes to a close. Embarrassing for Deloya. Exciting for Pacquiao. Right here you see Pacquiao landing punch after punch. And it's not so much just the way he's landing him. The body language and position of De La Hoya's body is that of a man that's defeated. It's, it's passive. He looks Almost like supernaturally he's... big welterweight. Antonio Margarito. All right, Larry, you envision this one. Could you see Pacquiao against Margarito? No, and he himself says he's going back to 140 after this fight. This could be the end of the fight here. Yeah, Oscar has no defense at all. It's, it's, it's not at all. Tony Weeks has a tough decision in front of him. There's a lot of glory and a lot of money in Oscar Delaware's past, but he's getting beaten up here. We're going to stop it. Better we stop it. That's, it's our decision, Oscar. It's a decision that we have to take. There's no reason to continue with this. He's too fast. Are you okay? You're with that? You agree? The official time at the end of round eight, referee Tony Weeks calls a halt to the bow. The winner by TKO victory and still the number one pound for pound fighter in the world, the fighting pride of the Philippines, Manny. Pac-Man! Pacquiao! Most of the crowd on its feet as they watch the two fighters trade through the round and beyond. And Trinidad almost looks out on his Feet. Hopkins imposing his will and his skill on the man who is tonight. Oh, huge right hand. Huge right hand by Hopkins. Down goes Trinidad. He's got the desire. He's never been knocked out. This fight is over. Steve Smoker stops it. No. Bernard Tito Hopkins Trinidad comes in. Has and done it. He knocked out Trinidad sensational power shot show in the 12th round. Oh, what a right hand, George. What a right hand. Every shot. This guy was so, I never thought his legs could last, but I guess those 150 pounds, exactly what he needed to move around. His last fight, and Rayfield suggested to Hopkins two possible opponents. Oh, oh big oh, right hand. He's out. Oh, out three. Oh, oh, my gosh. That's Joe crazy. Smith, yeah, that's Dan crazy. Rayfield suggested as an opponent, Five, has just knocked six, Bernard Hopkins out of the seven, ring. Eight, nine, out of the ring. Ten, 11, he should have 20 12, seconds to get back in. 13, if he can get back in in 20 14, seconds, he's not knocked 15, out. I don't think he's aware of that. And he's being he's assisted. Out, he's 18, being assisted by a lot of people 18, at ringside. Out his feet. That should disqualify him. He's out on his feet, though. And it's over. It's over, and it's going to be a knockout victory for Joe Smith. Bernard Hopkins got knocked out of the ring almost exactly as Joe Lewis did against Rocky Marciano in his last fight. Harold, I'm saying, here's another look at what happened. Joe Smith lands a left hook, another left hook, and then...
big punch. Was a big punch, Joe. Was a big Hopkins through the ropes. That one hurt him. Yeah, the right hand was huge. Yeah, that one finished it. And that was a big punch through the ropes. He landed on his head. That's what Pretty hurt. remarkable that he's still conscious. Yes, that's what hurt. Better look from this angle. Right hand was huge. Another left hook. Another left hook. Through the ropes onto his head. 15, 16. In the sixth round. And that stopped his ball. Big right hand and down goes Chavez. Will he get up? And will he continue? I'm not sure he wants to continue. Costa Zoo is a great finisher. He has Chavez in trouble, and there are almost two minutes left in this round. If this fight gets out of the sixth round, it will be surprising. Chavez comes after him and takes a big left hook. He's getting whacked with big shots. Costa Zoo looking to the referee because of more low blows, but Chavez keeps punching. It's a war here in the sixth round. It gives Chavez credit for fighting back. Zoo whacking him with punch after punch. It was competitive for one round, and since then it has not been. And Bobby Ferreira says enough is enough. Costa Zoo is still champion. And the career of Julio Cesar Chavez may just have ended.